Hey everybody, this is my new dress from Ross. It looks like it's suede, but it's not. And I had to stand back a little ways so you guys could see the fringe work on it. Okay, I had to grab it. It was $13.99. And this is the outfit of the day for fall. And my jewelry, of course, I got from Amazon.com. Okay, it's not one necklace, it's actually two. Okay, so thanks so much for watching. Bye. Hello, YouTube people. This is Tracy here. And I'm doing another fall outfit of the day. And it's to show you guys uh, this new snakeskin dress with pockets that I got from Ross. And you guys get a better view of it here. See, it has pockets. It's kind of like a, uh, it has an A-line shape. And these leather pants, I got them from Forever 21. And I will show you up close that they have zippers here on both sides two zippers there and they have a zipper at the ankle where my boots are covering it okay and the boots also came from Payless so all of this is an outfit that can be done for under $50 actually this was only $11.99 the pants were $19.99 this I've already told you guys about and bought that at another time downtown okay so uh, that's the outfit of the day and of course, this came from Amazon. All right, thanks for watching. Bye. Hello, fall fashionistas. Okay, this is another fall outfit. Uh, this is new, of course, and I have modeled this before. But my pants, however, are something old. I've had them a long time. And what I wanted to say is that these are not suede, it's just a fabric that happens to look that way. So you can actually go to a fabric store and actually make these pants because this fabric is probably there if not something close to it. And it's just a simple pant and it has a just a waistband here. It has no zipper in the front, no, no ties or nothing. It just slips right on. I've had these like forever. The, these pants are at least 25 years old for me. This top is also pretty much the same thing, and I can get a little closer. This top came from Forever 21, and I bought this back in the 90s when 70s type clothing was very, very popular. Okay, and the vest fits perfectly with it. So I'm just giving ideas of how to put things together for fall that are fashionable, that are creative, and possibly different from what your neighbor is wearing or your friends up the street. Okay, so you want to go out there for what's different, for what's creative. It gets people talking, you know, has them thinking, hey, I can put that together, I can do that, or I can be creative too. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, who says that in fall weather you have to be boring? You don't have to be boring. You can be exciting. Wear what you like, it puts a smile on your face and says, hey, I'm into fashion here. <laughs> All right. Thanks so much for watching. If there is a next video, you will see it. But until next time, bye. Hello, YouTube people. This is Tracy here. I am modeling another outfit for fall that I, uh, the only newest thing that I have on here are the pants. And this, uh, I guess you could say kimono. The kimono was popular this year, I guess in July, but it is a great item for fall. You can use it in your wardrobe to wear your pants. Uh, I use it sometimes for pants or because it's cold outside, I had to bring this video indoors. So that's why I'm in here now showing you what I have here. This is a studded belt. I've had it a long, long time. I don't know if it's popular or if it's possible to even get the belt today because I bought it at a thrift shop. So thrift shops tend to carry the things that people don't think are fashionable anymore. So Goodwill, uh, any other type of thrift shop, Salvation Army thrift shop, places like that will still have things like this and all you gotta do is just like look around. It shouldn't be more than $5 if you, you know, find it. But yeah, this is a perfect outfit for a cold day or a rainy day because the rain is not going to affect leather pants and these are pleather so 
so they are animal friendly, but I do own at least two pairs of real leather pants. Okay, so this is the outfit today. All right, I don't know if you guys can see the whole thing, but I still have my glasses on. Okay, so thanks so much for watching. Bye. Hello, fall fashion fashionistas. This is another outfit of the day for fall. And this is a African-inspired skirt uh, with a Tanzanian print. And I will get up close to show you just how that looks. Okay. I got this skirt from a little store called Q. Q is like a 579 store, which is just right for me because I'm right in the middle of that. So I always go there or Forever 21 to buy petite clothing because that's really what I am. Okay, so basically what I'm showing you is petite fall fashion. And if I have anything else to show you, uh, I will pleasantly do that. And also I want to mention that this blouse came from Forever 21. It's dome and sleeves. Very simple. With the right jewelry, it can look even better than I have it looking right now. All right, and my suede boots, they are from Thrift Shop. Very hard to find right now. All right, thanks so much. Bye.